The banking sector in Cyprus has gone through what can only be described as a cardiac arrest. It has been recapitalized and reformed by the actions of the government and the Resolution Authority and the Troika very recently. The people of Cyprus have less confidence in the banking Cyprus than they have had historically and it is the job of all of the managers and all of the people in the banking sector in Cyprus to recover the confidence of the depositors and the businesses in Cyprus so we can make it stronger again. The Bank of Cyprus accounts for 37% of all lending to the Cyprus economy today. It is the backbone of the Cyprus economy and it is inextricably linked with the trajectory of the Cyprus economy. Our job, my job, everyone's job in the bank is to spend time recovering the quality of the assets in the bank such that we can create a confident environment for people to come back and be depositors with the bank. This will create a valuable bank, but this will take time. I would envisage that as the Cyprus economy continues to contract through 2014, that we will continue to have you know, difficulty on our balance sheet. But as the Cyprus economy begins to recover and regain strength, the bank, its value and, the, and, it, and its relevance to the economy in terms of the provision of credit will improve with that. We are going to have a hallmark of transparency, honesty and engagement with our stakeholders. And our stakeholders are many. They are our employees, they are our shareholders, they are our depositors, they are the general population and investors in the Cypriot economy. Our job is to rebuild trust and confidence in the banking sector and importantly in the Bank of Cyprus. That will only happen if we have a direct and engaged relationship with all of the stakeholders that are relevant to the bank.